Greetings and hallucinations, ladies and lads. I am Chancellor of the Harmonious Frequencies of the Mighty Empire of Onion, and this is the Universe Sim. Well, if you checked out the link in the video description of the last episode, you would know that um, the game has had a serious update. I went ahead and set my uh, Steam to update the game to the experimental version, uh, which is pretty great. You can see up here, we already had the happiness meter. Uh, now we also have crime. Crime is almost non-existent uh, thanks to the extreme public happiness. Plus six stone hut and eatery. I'm not sure why it looks like the hospital is bringing it down. Uh, but there it is. Uh, so yeah, I brought the civilization up. I had to start a the game completely over, so this is a new planet. Uh, new location. I had to bring the civilization back up uh, roughly to where we had it. I think I've researched a couple of extra things. Um, let's see, I haven't gotten hunting yet, which we did have in the last place. Uh, we don't have warehouses yet. We're working on ancient burials right now, and then I would like to get um, let's see some water storage. What do we need for this? Material refinement. Yeah, so let's get that done, and then we'll pop into woodline reservoirs and see how that helps us uh, but yeah basically pretty close to where we were before we've got the cooking oils fishing uh, I I deepened the uh, water pit into a dug well so that's a thing now um, then we have growing I went to uh, grasslands to get the uh, new fruit uh, because he he asked for that same miracle, and I found manbro fruit, which grow in grasslands, and the crystalline crab apple, which grow in grasslands. Uh, we can see here this is the growth time, right? Two. I don't know what the two is, but you can see when we mouse over, it takes ten minutes. Uh, and then this is the yeah amount of food you receive. So the manbro fruit is the best so far. They all grow in two, uh, and we only get six, eight, and then ten for the amounts of food. So yeah, manbro fruit is the best. This is how much water that they require, all the same. Crack creator? I think one of your nuggets broke something. Oh no. Yep, he is injured. So let's go ahead and heal him up. We do have the the shaman hut. There we go. Anti city Alley? Hmm, I can see how that research could be useful, Creator. I'm picturing nuclear waffle irons, or maybe some kind of automated back scratcher. Stop me if I'm wrong. <laughs> okay, uh, I don't think burying people near the water is probably a good idea. So maybe we'll bring this over here. I tried to find a, uh, a pretty good place in the center of three lakes to start the civilization let's put it here as a matter of fact um, and you can see this lake is actually enormous absolutely here's a whale I don't know if we saw one in the last couple of episodes and of course it's nighttime as I zoom in on him kind of difficult to see there you can see the glowing fish in the water yeah there's a pretty glorious looking whale Quite fantastic, I would say. And I am looking forward to getting the hunting huts because it turns out the wolves will eat your nuggets. Um, yeah, that sounds exactly how it is. Um, I had a nugget over here just hanging out. It was my beginning uh, female, the Eve character, you might say. And um, the wolf just came right up and devoured her and then took off running. I don't know uh, what happened to the corpse. It was just laying around here for the longest time. Uh, I built the farm on top of where she died. Maybe it's a uh, fertilizer by this point. Without trying to be too insensitive. Yeah, storage areas. I wanted to see what the um, what the warehouse is like. Uh, but you can see we haven't gotten far. Uh, stone refinery, wood refinery are still locked. We've just got the fishing uh, pier. And the farm. I only have one fishing pier set up at the moment. 
There's the glorious whale I'm again. I'm going out for some groceries. Can I get you anything? Oh, sure. Uh, I would take a uh, peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Maybe some coffee. So, uh, local businesses I don't know about. We haven't gotten to that point yet. It looks like a small market or something like that. Uh, but then the hunter's hut is in the queue so far to be researched. So the warehouse is what we're trying to unlock now. Um, I'm not sure what they do with this. I guess they just move uh, resources that are laying on the ground to the warehouse. We've got batteries and uh, courier huts. Which I'm not sure what that is either, but um, it'll be interesting to find out once we get to that point. Alright, so over here, kind of near to the cemetery. I want to build as much in grassland as I can. Uh, these larger industrial areas, so I'm not tearing down uh, very much woodlands. I don't know how much or how large the refineries are either, so I don't know. I want to probably try to fit a couple of them here, maybe. Um, I wouldn't mind having another fishing pier on this small pond here. Um, eventually over to this larger larger sized one back on this side. Have an eatery in this area, sort of. Uh, possibly a farm over here. See if this is forest. If not, uh, we could put the farm over here in this forest and give them the chance to grow forest crops. I could look around for more of those so that we could uh, quote-unquote research them. Yeah, we've got the forecast tower here. I picked a weatherman who's not very strong because he doesn't need to be. He just needs to climb up into the tower, look around, and uh, tell me what the forecast is going to be. I actually didn't have enough believers to... Um... What is she unhappy about? I didn't have enough believers to skip the winter, uh, but thankfully we had enough water in the uh, reservoir here to last. I built two water pumps almost right off the bat, and I built... Um, I have three wells uh, pretty quickly as well. Let's see if we can give her a little jolt, not electrify, kickstart here, and see if this helps out. Doesn't look like it did. Citizen of Mother Planet, laborer, doing nothing, has kids, has a wife, no education, they are at 100, yep, I'm not sure what this uh, battery icon is, oh, they have an election, different candidates for, uh, for leadership, Looks like they want education here. Yeah, accelerated studies, uh, vaccination laws, influence Nugget's decision to vote for them, move to Nugget location, and science here. More on research than on religion. Increased research rate, but uh, decreased to creator point production. We have a ton of creator points, and I would love to get more research it's on. It's getting a bit chilly in here. So I think Winter I may influence. Coming, creator. Yep. I may influence their uh, decision to vote for her. The accelerated studies is kind of nice. Reduce school time, but we don't even have schools available. So that doesn't make any sense to me. And we don't, uh, we don't have access to shots yet. So Sutoti is looking to be the oh, best. I'm sorry, did I catch you at a bad time? Yeah, looking to be the best uh, candidate there. We acquired a new believer in the process. That's good. Uh, yeah, three herbs, 12 medicines, so she is maxed out on medicines. We haven't had any sickness. We had that one uh, broken bone that we healed. No problem. Okay, you got the mambro fruit, that's good. As far as our powers and stuff, I've been wondering if the uh, trickle effect here, um, if we run low on water, in the lakes and stuff if I can use the rain uh, to refill them. I'm not sure if that's the case or not. Because this isn't even ticking down very far. It's only 20 below the max. And so I'm not sure if I can even empty this thing out. It's huge. And so that's why I picked it first to put the uh, to put the pumps on. 
Oh yeah, we've got another regular injury. Can I... I'm pressing F to zoom in. I right click on it, it doesn't do anything. Can't double click it. Just gonna have to look around for someone who's injured. Using chopsticks instead of a fork. A pretty inadequate uh, deity if I have to look around manually to see injured nuggets. Who did it say that it was? There we go. Oh, she's already in here. And we had uh, maximum medicine, so I think I'm going to let the shaman take care of this. She's doing a good job anyway. Look at her. Do the little dance. Make a little noise. Get down tonight. Wonderful. They're going to be healed in no time. Let's get the hunters uh, on the case here. Resources management. We already built the warehouse over here. Oh, nice. Wow. Yes. Sutodi. Scientific focus. Celebrate. Minus 100 creator points, but plus 5 happiness. And we're already... Nibbler? What does this mean? Workaholic makes sense. I don't know if I should make a Nibbler my, uh... My cemetery lady, Undertaker. That seems a little bit questionable, eh? I would say. Okay. Uh, so now material refinement's the only thing we have right now. Uh, going for us. Let's see what other research. I wanted it so I could get this immediately afterwards. Uh, for some reason, even though this is in the queue, it's not going to let me queue this up until it's finished. Additional worker slot. I was looking for uh, worker slots for um, the engineer's hut. This looks like the first upgrade that I can get to the engineer's hut from what I can see. So we've got the local business, recreation there. Culture unlocks last names. Group meals. Food needs reduced by 20%. That's pretty huge, actually. Water needs reduced. Fishing hut upgrade. That would be nice to do. Okay. We'll check it out. Uh, first, though, I wanted to get the... Yeah. The hunter's hut. Let's actually place them down... I think the wolves are mostly behind us. So let's place them down over here. By the farm and the uh, and the shaman and the eateries right here as well. The current Hunting eatery is an essential survival tool. Yeah. When the lakes are frozen and bushes no longer bear fruit, hunting will keep your nuggets alive. Had another injury at work. Is this the same person? Are they just prone to injury. Oh, it was him, but he's fully healed now. I'm not sure why that's still sticking around. It's fine though. That looks like a rather rough process. Let's hope nobody gets hurt. Woohoo! That's right. Try and peek in here. I also um, figured out that whenever the Nugget asked me to help them build the stone hut, instead of moving the stacks of resources that I found on the ground. What it was wanting me to do was to pick up an entire tree and drop it on the hut, and then pick up an entire stone and drop it on the hut, instead of the raw resources by themselves. So I was able to get the Divine Architect or something like that uh, achievement for for that. Okay, so we've got 3 out of 20 in that well. Here's another one. 5 out of 20. So we're not short on drinking water at the moment. That's good. Uh, we are spreading out quite a bit, though, so I may I may go ahead with that idea to get um, more fishing and stuff going over on this side. I think we have the workers for it and everything, too, so... Yeah, we'll put down a fishery right there. Should be fine. 
And then on the research panel, I wanted the wood line reservoirs next. Uh, water flow study. We could get a well upgrade. Um, I feel like that would be kind of nice. We'll get the fishing hut upgrade. Increase nugget health. Would be nice. Additional worker for the eatery uh, is good. I noticed this too. This makes the nuggets move faster. Uh, this gives them a might of plus four. They're all pretty weak already, so I think a higher might would be good. This is a defensive tower. I could research this and then not actually, um, not actually build it if that was what I wanted to do. So we'll go this direction for now. Um, okay, so we got the fish built here. Let's cancel that. I don't want it built on top of the food. I didn't realize that that uh, plant was there. So let's build it down here then. Uh, let's build... While frozen lakes are fun to skate on, creator, they also prevent water pumps from working. Yes. We are quite aware of this. Um, the eatery right here isn't bad. A little bit closer. I don't want it to wipe out that plant either. So we'll do this here and then another... Um, why is this flashing? Oh, we have the refineries up. That's good. We'll go for a farm. Yeah, a forest farm. Are we killing any natural plants? It doesn't look like it. Did you know that snow isn't white? It's an illusion, a simple trick. You can go ahead and take a closer look. Let's just bump it up to spring. We should have enough... Uh, water in the reservoir but in fact we almost have too much so we could do with another water storage we could fit one here as a matter of fact I hope you've got some flea powder handy creator there's a ragged bunch of wolves approaching your civilization oh yeah one of your nuggets has taken ill after drinking from the lake creator why or will follow they're not very good at identifying patterns yet. Do them a favor and build some wells. Yeah, I have plenty of wells around. I guess they're not as full anymore as I assumed that they were. We should be okay now, though. Okay. Uh, these guys are building in a strange spot that I wasn't expecting them to. If we bring up the wood refinery... I want to minimize stone hut casualties. I think this one is probably going to go. And then a uh, stone refinery right next to it. Oh, come on. Okay, I can place it further back. There we go. Yeah. I'm sorry, stone hut. I'm sorry. Two nuggets have died. Yeah. Wild animals are really coming in and devouring things. Yeah, here they are. Killing people. Vicious creatures. Um, I could slow it down a bit, I guess. And see if I can destroy them. I don't know if any of this is a good idea. I was thinking just straight lightning. didn't work. It did not work. This is clearly what we need watchtowers for, though. Is the hunting hut finished? I don't think it is. I want some with decent might. This is a hermit. Lazy. Workaholic. She doesn't have good might, though. 
Adahi, you're pretty good. Let's see, we can sort them by might as well. I want to keep Creator, some... I'm hearing reports of Nuggets narrowly avoiding death by falling debris. Okay. Maybe it's a good idea to invest in some more engineer's huts? Probably. It probably is. I there would like just... buildings without workers, Creator. That's like ordering a pizza just to stare at it. Is that because all of my folk are dying to wolves? We still have 38... Yeah, we don't have... Ugh, we don't have any kind of firefighting structure either. Alright, we're gonna have to see if we can, uh... Rain on this. There we go. Put it out ourselves. Ugh, what a tragedy. You would think that striking a wolf with lightning would kill it. Uh, but it's not the case. Not the case at all, sadly. Okay, hopefully these guys will go after those wolves, though, and uh, kill them. Sutoti? I'm pretty sure that's the leader. Yeah, we'll upgrade. We could probably go for upgrading both fishing piers. It looks like that stops them from working uh, for the time being, but it should be okay. There will be no whistling while they work. Okay, we're work working on a reservoir. This one is full. So we should be okay on all that. Got plenty of slots here, but it doesn't look like, um... Doesn't look like they've brought anybody in. We have plenty of dead nuggets laying around, sadly. I'm not sure how I brought up... There we go. I think those are old messages. I think these are new. Wild animals. I could be wrong. I could have that backwards. What? Oh, no. This can't go on. Ooh, what's Retrieve that it and place it in the created? cemetery. Oh, what a pity. It appears that one of your nuggets has passed on. However, they left something odorous behind. Oh no. Okay. Get to scrubbing. Clear infection. All right. Here is a corpse. I bet they've never felt so good. Whatever will they again? Uh, <laughs> sure. Ah, oh, we got it. We got it. Nice. Do you enjoy music, creator? I was thinking about taking up the violin. It'll come in handy when something tragic happens. Yeah. You are absolutely right. Okay. So we can apparently um, drop these corpses straight in. They're not always pleased about it, but this is how it is. There you go. Since my undertaker apparently isn't working, I guess she's bored, tired or something. He wasn't buried for some reason. I wonder if it was because somebody else was being buried at the time. There we go. Oh, so at least those three have been buried. And it looks like people are thirsty. People are hungry. So I'm, I have been falling behind on my food production and stuff. It looks like they've got some foods 
around. Let's see. Yeah, actually, you would be fine. There's a lot of... Uh, these are all grassland crops, so I need to find um, forest crops. There are a lot of hermits in this village, though. That's for sure. Okay, I'm pretty sure that this healthy Molina is a forest crop. So let's do a research on this. I don't think it matters which uh, farm we drop it in either. The closer down you get, uh, the less it has to drop, so that's nice too. Okay, yeah, 262. So it's going to be this one that you're planting. I'll go around looking for more though. Just to be sure. And now this watchtower uh, is not going to go unused any longer. Since I know that they will come and attack like that. Deadly seed, those are herbs. I don't know if they'll grow herbs in the... In the uh, farms. I have yet to try that. Manbro fruits are grasslands. Bloody diarrheas, grasslands. These are probably grasslands. Crystalline crab apple. I don't think I've grabbed any of these up. I could be wrong. Can I see a farm from here? Oh yeah. Grasslands. The summer sun is excellent for slow roasting a few nuggets. That's right. Put away your furry fuzzy slippers, I mean. Alright, let's see some more woodland crystalline. Those are mambros. I've gotten to where I can almost tell. Those are eggs right there. What are they going to hatch into, I wonder? Delicious. Devil's lettuce is in herbs. The cactus is used for wood. And we are going to build some watchtowers. Man. Not I'm seeing very many. One of your nuggets has passed away. Oh no. Death can happen so suddenly. However, the death of one does not necessarily mean the end of everything. It was simply their time to go. Don't blame yourself, creator. Well, Unless you were actually responsible, I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> right. Caused themselves an injury, so did, did they die of an injury? Who knows? We're probably going to have to uh, freshen up the area, though. Let's see. Desert. Panda brain plum is a desert plant. Yeah, let's make sure that that doesn't get uh, too nasty there. And there was a juicy acorn back over in that area. Is this a juicy acorn? That's a panda brain. Devil's lettuce. I just want to see if this juicy acorn is a forest. It's got to be, right? Panda brain. Healthy Molina. And there's so much I want to do, and I feel like we're out of time for this episode already. All right, juicy acorns. Let's bring these back in. Let's see, we're up to 45 nuggets, too. That's pretty good, I'd say. Where's the shadow? There it is. Aha! So they're equal here. Yeah, not meant for the current biome. And we're only missing what, four more species here. That looks like it is devil's lettuce. So maybe they can grow herbs. I may have to try that out. But that's going to have to be for uh, next episode. Let's see if we can throw down a watchtower. Here we go. Over here in the, uh, in the mountains. Because this is the direction that the wolves usually come from. 
I'll have to try to remember to put workers in there. I think there were bears out here too. And it looked like those have an area of protection. Yeah. I'm glad it shows the other one too when we bring this up. So we could throw another one out um, this direction. Because I know that there were wolves coming up this way. Somebody just got injured over here it looks like. Or died. We can place that there. Oh, that was a fox. Okay, good. These are my hunters here, bringing in materials. Man. Okay, I can play this game forever, but that's going to be it for this episode. If you want to catch another one, be sure to subscribe. Consider supporting my channel through the Patreon link down in the video description. And feel free to check out any of my other videos or playlists that you might be interested in. I thank you so much for all the time you spend on my channel. And I hope blessings of wisdom and peace on all of you.